Don't worry, Jude. I'll explain your predicament to the villagers after the ceremony. Please be patient for just a little longer. Uh, sure. Okay, let's get hunting for those temporal stones. You said they were in the village? Yes. Gather the stones and bring them to the shrine. It lies beyond the village. mountain beyond the village sure is something. That's the Neokara Halamont. It's a special land where four spirit climbs... Here we go. This must be one of the temporal stones. Correct. We need three more just like that. Kara really is the sticks, huh? How about we just call it simple? Welcome home, Lord Maxwell. I'm glad to see you're all well. All thanks to you, Lord Maxwell. Wow. So people really do worship Mila. It's pretty rare to find Maxwell worshippers these days, but apparently they used to be quite common. Faith in the spirit seems to have fallen dramatically all over the world. Although I couldn't tell that from here. The more spirit arts progress, the more spirits are seen as simply another facet of nature. So they used to be a bigger deal back then? Yeah. Legends say that it was the spirit Maxwell who created Riza Maxia to begin with. And the first human to follow him, Kresnik, came to be known as the Genesis Sage. Correct. And the people of this village are Kresnik's descendants. <laughs> Yeah, you get crazy origin stories like that in all these rustic towns. How dare you! Twenty years ago, I personally witnessed the advent of Lord Maxwell and the Four Great Spirits. I saw her grow into the woman you see before you without ever taking a bite of food or a wink of sleep. This miracle is proof that our legends were true. Wanna tell this geezer about the time Mila collapsed from hunger? Just leave him alone. Come to think of it, the six ruling houses of Rashigal are all a part of that legend too. Their founders were supposed to be the six disciples of Maxwell and Kresnik, right? Now that is the truly absurd origin story. Those fools have no clue about the true secrets of this world. I should never have said that. Please, forgive me. What just happened? Nothing. Don't worry about it. This is your hometown, Mila? It's so... normal. Isn't it nice? It's so quiet here. Yeah, it sure is. Pretty weak, huh? I was expecting something freaky. Hey, come on. Did you say something? Oh, I was just wondering if your parents were around. Spirits don't have parents. And how were you born? I took this form 20 years ago. I appeared, along with the four, in the village shrine. Why? You seem to have a lot of questions about me. Just trying to keep Jude entertained. He was complaining about how boring the village was. Jude, do you crave chaos that much? What? I, I didn't say anything like that.
These are such weird buildings. The villagers channel a combination of earth and wind spirits when constructing them. There we go. All four temporal stones. I appreciate your efforts. Let's bring them to the shrine beyond the village. So, all the arts that channel the four great spirits don't work anymore? Yeah, not since the silencing 20 years ago. The power of the four disappeared overnight, causing a worldwide panic. And when did Mila take human form again? 20 years ago. Wait, are the two related? Yes, that was me. I reserved the four for my personal use. Seriously? I have no reason to deceive you. Of course, even I can't summon them now. So you'll have to take my word for it. Thank you. 